Uh, hey guys, we are going to start episode number eight. Uh, we are going to talk to a few people here. I believe Codsworth was running around trying to get my attention. Uh, maybe I'm supposed to. I know I'm supposed to talk to Sturgis. Well, I'll sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Oh, feels good. I was glad to help. Well, I appreciate it. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door's always open. It better fucking be open because I did. Well, the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. This homie is talking about Fort Bud Light like it's some kind of trash bin. But anyways, uh, there's Fort Bud Light. Uh, we're looking for Codsworth. He was floating around somewhere. And he said something about Concord. Which made me think there he is. Which made me think maybe something is there. Oh, yes, we did. You could say that. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. As available as your companion. I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Would you like to? As you wish, sir. I'd like to trade some items. Of course. So, Codsworth basically can just hold shit for me. That looks to be the extent of what he can do. But that's okay, because we have a lot of stuff for him to hold, I feel like. Um, I feel like he can take this. Uh, he can definitely take this. Some of this stuff I don't see myself using. Um, just for the simple fact that I don't want to use it, I guess. I don't want, like, Codsworth to die or some shit and I'm not be able to use my power armor. But I feel like that is a pretty good... Well, we got 50 pounds, though. I don't want to sell that stuff, but keep it Codsworth. Um, we have things to do now. All right, so I would fast travel, but I refuse to fast travel in this game just yet. For the simple fact is there's so much stuff. There is so much stuff. All right, so what I think we're going to do is instead of uh, last episode, we went to the satellite station. Or no, that was in episode six. That was a long time ago. Um, these guys are pretty happy so we're gonna go back to the red rocket truck stop and then we're gonna go around down this way and hopefully run into something around here but we but we are going to sprint I just saw something splash in the water hopefully it's not one of those fucking things we saw in episode 3 that was a tire because that thing beat my ass. Alright, so if there is a workstation here, that means I can make this into an outpost, right? So the workshop. Yeah, so I can make this an outpost. Um, which seems really cool to me that you can have outposts, especially so close together. Um, but one thing that we're looking for is some gears transfer I don't understand oh I can store all my junk all oh, that frees up a ton of space okay this is beautiful okay that's that's just nifty I greatly greatly appreciate that uh can I is this gonna give me yes that's gonna give me some gears beautiful okay so if you guys didn't watch the last episode 
you will now know that I needed uh, some gears for an auto turret and I'm definitely going to uh, take those back there to uh, store all junk so I should have So why wouldn't it default do that? Okay, so now I have two gears. Okay, cool. All right, so now that we have our gears and I know that if I need to, I can make this place safe. Uh, I think that's pretty important. So what we're gonna do, so it looks like there is some type of building or whatever. Let's just go ahead and check this thing out. Fuck it. This is why I love this game. You literally Skyrim every game like this. And I'm so excited to be exploring something like brand new that people don't even know about yet. So it doesn't look like anything is too crazy out here. Okay, so this bloat fly is a real pain in the ass it looks like. Oh shit, looks like we got another one. Alright, nice job, dog. So this looks pretty cool. This looks like an encampment. Maybe either by settlers or some fucking evil dogs. Fuck your evil dog stuff. So that looks like some random bros over there. Maybe they're hostile. I, every person we've seen so far has wanted to kill us except the Minutemen. So, which I think would have been cool if you could just kill the Minutemen and then maybe like set up a raider camp. I think that would be kind of cool. I want to. I'm gonna look at all of these places. These guys hostiles or no? So is this? Don't have anything to sell. I'm on my way to Vault 81 to restock. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So he just told us about Vault 81, which uh, Vault 81. So it looks like it's right outside of Diamond City. So that's good to know. Um, let's go ahead and start over here. We're just going to work our way down the map because I could look at this game all freaking day. Okay, so this looks like we're probably going to get some good stuff. Of course we are. If you look, you will find in Fallout 4. That is just how it works. So I don't know what this giant... Uh, thing up here is oh this looks like some bedded down beasts it's a brahmin well we didn't kill it but I'm not that worried about it if we could have killed it maybe we could have got some like good stuff out of it okay so it looks like it's just a house Maybe we took somebody's stuff. I don't know. Rain, ranger cabin. Okay. So it looks like we're not... Oh, shit. This doesn't really... Runaways hollow tape. A laundered green dress. Maybe I'll need that for one of my hoes. Where is all this shit? There it is. Alright, so your trivia question, uh, if you guys haven't guessed it already, okay. Less damage from melee attacks. Okay, that's pretty nifty. Um, if you guys haven't guessed, um, 
how many two-headed motherfuckers did we see? And it would be two two-headed motherfuckers. Chemistry station. Uh, I'm in combat, apparently. But I don't see anything, so... We're just going to move right along. I found the ranger station. Not sure what exactly that means. Um, next, we are going to hit up this little this little thing. This looks like it's pretty well inhabited, well built up. So I assume that there will be people here, hopefully to trade. That's what I'm really looking for, is someone to trade with. Somebody I can make money off of. Uh, I will pr probably need these. Hopefully it's not somebody else's food. If I were them, I would be salty. I don't really see any way to get inside here. Okay, Abernathy Farm. There's a freaking cat. Hey, there's a one-headed motherfucker. Or, a one-headed motherfucker. A two-headed motherfucker. Uh... So Abernathy Farms looks pretty bare. Okay, someone is living here because I can steal stuff, so. Um. Hey there. <laughs> hey, wake up. I'm a creepy guy that came in the middle of the night. Oh, there's two women. Maybe the men sleep upstairs? Um, okay, that was nifty. <laughs> dog. I wish you could name your dog. That's something that I kind of want to do. So is there... Is there any way... So it just looks like two two women run this farm. And that's that's pretty cool. Um, I, I guess. If you're into that sort of thing. What the hell? This dog just opens the door. Here, watch this. The dog just opens doors like it's nobody's business. Okay, so the next place we're going to visit. I'm stealing stealing more of your food. This looks like more of a... Well, let's check out this place first. This is so cool. Like, there's so many little buildings and places to go. Things to do. It's just fucking cool. Like, there's just... Just no other way to put it, you know? It's a mattress. Looks like some. Oh no, those are cigarettes. A carrot. Beer bottle. So maybe. This kind of looks like a dangerous spot. Now we have quite a few bobby pins, so I don't really feel as bad about breaking one. But when we had one and we were in the, the whatever you call that, well, that was kind of stressful. Like I was, I was really trying to pick that freaking lock. Um, this is so beautiful. I okay, I'm getting a graphics card like within the next month, hopefully, and I will run this game at ultra settings, and I'm super excited to do that. So, uh, wicked shipping fleet lockup. I heard... Holy fuck! Fucking ghoul, man. I, kn I knew it. I knew it. Okay, as soon as I heard that sound... Fucking ghouls, man. I'm... Ah, oh, man. Alright, I know there's gonna be some fucking ghouls in here. I gotta clear this fucking place out. I knew... Dude, as soon as I heard that sound... I knew it was a fucking ghoul. There's a guy. Is that a backpack? A fuse we can use. A fuse we can use. Ha ha ha. You get it? My jokes are stale. 
So there's only one ghoul here. Um, let's go ahead and keep looking around. Start over here in this building. Oh, dude, why you gotta why you gotta get up like that? Did you see that, man? That's like some Walking Dead shit. Do you guys watch The Walking Dead? I love The Walking Dead. And A Game of Thrones. What's your guys' favorite TV show? Or do you have one? I didn't normally... I'm going to have to listen to that. Yeah, stop kicking shit around. Get out of the way, dog. Um, what's your guys' favorite TV show? That's my, uh, my question to you. Uh, even though I did the trivia earlier in the episode. Uh, what's your guys' favorite uh, TV show? Generally curious. But since we have a... I hear a guy somewhere. Hopefully there's a workbench. This would be a cool place to... Uh... Actually, I think he is, uh, I think that is a recording or a radio. Ooh. We'll take it, right? Actually, let's go ahead and try a different weapon. We haven't really tried a different weapon yet. Oh, uh, we got a couple of badass pistols. Like, uh, this one. This was the hair trigger pistol. doesn't really look or this is what I want to try it's okay I guess I don't know yet we won't find out until we start blasting some ghouls and shit there's some more 10 minutes one thing I appreciate about this game oh fuck I hate shit that like lays down and it just gets up like ah freaks me out man freaks me the fuck out I I hate ghouls I hate zombies I know that there will be some like good ghouls in this game but man I'm not like I'm not looking forward to like racist or nah man I'm just scared just scared, man. What is. And there's still like creepy music playing, so. I don't think I killed this one. Whatever. We're going upstairs now. Oh, okay. There's a ghoul on top of that building, somehow. I'm waiting for this bitch to... Oh, get out of my way. I'm trying to loot, dog, and you're out here making it difficult on me. There really wasn't anything here. Except that pipe pistol. Alright, so let's... Let's jump on top of here. Since this ghoul is going to get up on us. Oh no, that's a dead guy. Oh shit. We probably don't need that money. So. I need to find. I feel like there should be a workbench here somewhere. But I don't see it anywhere. Gold plated flip lighter. Probably something here cool, but okay. We're going to end this episode here. Uh, remember, your trivia was the how many two-headed motherfuckers did we see? And we saw two two-headed motherfuckers. Uh, I don't see a workbench. Oh, um, I guess we should try to like quick save here. Okay, so let's give this a try in Fallout 4. I know I'm going to get made fun of. Um... Okay, come on, come on. Alright, so hacking. Select a potential password. 
A to enter it. If you choose the password and correct, the number of letters that match the terminal's password with letter and position will be displayed on the screen. <sighs> okay. Hold on, is this? I won't end the episode yet. Reset, tries, reset. Oh, okay, so finding one of these resets your tries. Um, okay, let's go. Okay, so meet, entry denied. Likeness equals zero. I don't know exactly what that means. Yes. Tire. Sweet. So we get protection control. Standard protection control interface. This interface should be used. I completely guessed. Don't ask me. Um, choose personality mode. Let's go ahead and do that first. Uh, let's go ahead and do like law enforcement. See what that does for us. Okay, so we back out of here. This interface. Yeah, no, um, let's go ahead and activate these motherfuckers. Uh, okay. So do you just follow me around? I'm confused on what this is supposed to do for me. So do you follow me? I'm confused. Why do I need you? All right, let's let's try and run away from it and see if it follows us. It looks like it's just going to hang out here. Um which is cool, I guess. I feel like there should be a workbench here. Um, let me let me give like a quick once over. I, maybe in this building that I missed. It's a power armor thing. I've, like I feel like this place has to have one. Like it's it's got to. That's the armor workbench. Nothing. Nothing. Huh. Maybe you can't settle this place? Or whatever? I'm not sure exactly. So thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is episode number eight. I'll catch you guys on the next one. And we will continue our journey south as we continue to explore and expand uh, Wicked Shipping Fleet Lockup. So maybe that's just somewhere you have to come later. I'm not sure. But uh, hopefully we'll check out and see what's at the end of this road. Uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, sorry I keep rambling. Uh, game just great. I'll uh, catch you guys tomorrow. Thanks.